Welcome to the first installment of How To with Adobe Premiere Elements 12, brought to you by Clix. Today, I will be showing you how to animate a lower third. But first, I'd like to apologize for any background noise as I'm shooting this in the office. First, begin by clicking on the text tab, New Text, Default Text. Next, select the Add Text box and place your text inside of it. After that, you can go ahead and click on the Size tab and go ahead and change it to whatever you like. After that, you'll need to go down and click the Select tool and drag it into position. Once in position, go ahead to the top tab and locate the Shapes tab. From there, you can select from four options. For the purposes of this, I've chosen the square. Go ahead and drag it until you have it in place. Once in place, you can go ahead and change the color that you prefer. After that, right click, go down to Arrange, then click Send to Front, and you'll see your text appear. After that, you'll need to go to the Applied Effects tab. Locate the Motion tab. And once you've clicked the Motions tab, find the Key Frames tab. It's a little stopwatch to the left that's light blue. Once you've selected the keyframe, make sure that it's at the very end of your video. Then go ahead and slide the slider all the way back to the beginning. After that, you'll need to go ahead and select the numbers to the right of position. Slide that all the way until your animated third is off the screen. It may take a while, but it's worth it to make sure that the axis is continuous. After the third is off the screen, go ahead, slide that all the way back down, hit play, and look at the animated third which you've created. I hope this was helpful, and thanks for watching.